Okay, let's talk a little dollars and cents this morning. 6.37 your time and new government data shows there were more than 9 million job openings in the U.S. last month. Well, this morning, as businesses are struggling to get workers in the door, about half of the states have opted to end unemployment benefits early. This is an effort to try and force people to get back to work. Well, let's take a look at your screen now. As a part of the American Rescue Plan, the extra $300 weekly federal benefits were expected to expire in September, but Florida and more than 20 other mostly Republican-led states have now ended those payments early, saying that they discouraged Americans from getting back to work. Now, economists say so far that there's limited data showing that workers have come rushing back since these benefits were cut off. So I think many people were expecting to see a big surge, a big wave. We're not seeing a flood, um, but but there is evidence of, of, of you know, a small effect. So it's not going to be a big silver bullet, but there is evidence that people whose benefits are expiring earlier would like to start working earlier. So they say their ideal start date is a little bit sooner. Several states, including Indiana, Maryland, and Texas, are facing legal challenges from workers about whether governors have the authority to end the federal jobless benefits early.